Governor Kay Ivey in the meantime spent the morning in Fort Payne to break ground for what some believe will become a launching pad of opportunity. One local high school's hopes it will give students new reasons to dream bigger and reach higher. Way 31's morning anchor Chris Tatum was with the governor this morning and brings us the story. There is no turning back now. This pile of overturned dirt is proof. Fort Payne High School is definitely getting its brand new beat center. From video production, to first aid, to culinary classes, Fort Payne High School offers students a buffet of opportunity. Monday, Governor Kay Ivey showed students they can now dream even bigger by breaking ground for a new beat center, building electric aviation technology. Oh, I would love to work at Tesla. Clark McClung is a Fort Payne High School junior. Figures he'll be long gone by the time the new beat center is up and running. And with that uh, electric car course, I mean, it's a straight pathway to working at Tesla. Yep, the Beat Center will teach electric car technology plus construction, even help students get licensed to fly drones. All vocational trades Governor Ivey calls essential to keeping Alabama's workforce and economy strong. It will provide path, career pathways for the students going forward so they can get really good paying jobs when they graduate and finish high school. Right now, these students are focused on their futures and on the future students who, thanks to the new Beat Center, will learn new technologies they never dreamt of. Getting this new center is an absolutely amazing opportunity for students coming up from the middle school to have. Fort Payne High School leaders say right now they're not sure exactly when construction will start on this new Beat Center or when it will finish, but for students here, it can't happen soon enough. In Fort Payne, Chris Tatum, Way 31 News. After this morning's groundbreaking, Governor Kay Ivey tweeted, quote, in the last five years, we've seen nearly $19 billion in new capital investment and created more than 44,000 new jobs. Fort Payne's Beat Center will only support those efforts through vocation training.